Hey everybody, welcome back to more Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, and we are going to do, I believe, um, I think, we'll just keep on recording until I have to go because I really want to get some stuff done <laughs> before I have to go. And the reason why... I'm here at the Harlow Town Market is because there is a uh, mini game we can play somewhere. And it's this one right here. So, yes, here we are at the treasure box shop. Open the chest and it's a prize! If you find a key inside, you'll be able to advance left. All right, try your luck. Ten rupees to play. Do you want to try it? Yes. And we got a small key. And also, the the thing I recommend you to do is you basically have to use the Legend of Truth, or you cannot do it. I bet you. I think you can. Like if you're lucky enough, but. It's just way much easier if you um, get use the Legend of, Legend of Truth. I think it's also really cheating, but whatever. I like doing it this way. <laughs> and we keep on getting keys. So yeah, let's just keep on getting keys. And there we go. And yes, we're almost there. I don't know if the random order and where the keys are hidden is the same every time or if it's just random. And let's just see what's inside this treasure chest. I wonder what it is. I don't know. And yes. It is a piece of heart, and yes, we received another heart container. Gracias. Thank you very much. Yes, of course. We're almost way the way, we're almost there for getting all the heart pieces. Yeah, I know. It's awesome. And yes, of course, we have to go through all of these doors, and it's just really annoying. All right, so now we're done with that. So, uh, dang. um, as much as I don't want to, I guess we are going to have to start doing the, um, the Goron Sword side quest. Yes, this is the side quest of all the side quests. One of the most, the, the most hardest side quest in the whole entire game seriously side quest is just so hard well, I, don't know if it's, I don't know if it's so hard but it's really annoying and you could get worried a lot and you can kind of run out of time because there is a lot of time in this we have to beat this in a certain amount of time well, certain, well certain, never mind ha ah. uh, yeah Alright, so we are gonna warp to the graveyard, but we are not. No, we are not going to do the Shadow Tumble just yet. I might want to get a cup, a few heart pieces after we do the Begoron Sword before I. Well, before I enter the, the Shadow Temple. And I know I definitely want to get the. Grave digging mini game out of the way, cause it's just so so hard to complete. I mean, uh, and believe you need it to be daytime. You basically have to have it to be daytime. Or 
All right. So, what you have to do first is you have to talk to this girl. I read a new type of mi miniature cuckoo. It, I call it the pocket cuckoo. I don't get goosebumps from these, this baby. Cuckoos are very good at getting lazy. Playing risers are out of bed. Have you heard of them before? It makes them very happy to, to grow. Cuckoo! Especially when it wakes up a very heavy sleeper. However, my cuckoo is not entirely happy right now. You, you look like you are go good at handling cuckoos. Here, take this egg. After the cuckoo out, you bring me back up. Bring it back to me after a while. I'll check it out and see what, what do you think? Will you try? Yes. I'll try. I don't know how I look like a cuckoo handler or whatever she called me, but I, uh, I don't know. So, what we're going to have to do is head over to this building, because we're going to have to wake up a very heavy sleeper, and do you know who that is? Yes, I, yes, it, we have done this way in the past, and yet we, we have to do this yet again. And yes, it is this guy. No, wait, what? Oh wait, I completely forgot. Oh wow, I have to change it, make it to daytime and then nighttime, and then the 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 crow will hatch. Will the egg? All right. So, do it again. More time. And yeah, yeah, th yes, the chicken hatch from the egg. How wonderful. So. Cock a doodle doo! What in tarnation? Can't a person get a little shine around here? Do you say Marilyn thinks I'm going back to the ranch? Then Yahoo! Why don't you just go right now? Seriously, think about it. Alright, whatever. Let's talk to the girl again. I don't know why this place is raining. I have no clue why. Oh, your cuckoo looks pretty happy! He must have awakened an extremely lazy guy! You're a good cuckoo keeper! I'll give you a very valuable cuckoo, if you're interested. Its name is Kojiro, and it used to be my brother's cuckoo. Its blue body is quite charming, it's so cute. Since my brother has gone, it's strange, but Kuku Kojiro has stopped crowing. Do you want to keep Kojiro? Yes. Alright. Alright, so, what we're gonna do... We are going to warp to the forest, and, uh, yeah, because it's just a easier way of getting there. And we're also, yet again, going to be careful because of these, uh, angry guys. Uh, yeah, I hate this guy. I really do hate this guy. Slice! Slice! I need that, of course. Oh, jeez. Eh? Climb, climb, climb! Oh, that was really close. Thought that guy was gonna saw me. Or see me. <laughs> Honey. Wait, huh? Of course, my controller is rumbling. Let's see if there's a secret. Really? Of course. Why didn't I think of this? Whoa. This is cool. But I guess we're going to have to do whatever is in store for this for this place in the next episode. So, stay tuned to the next part of my Let's Play for The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe for the next episode. Goodbye!